Muhammad Ali, one of the greatest boxers in the history of boxing, was born on January 17, 1942, in Louisville, Kentucky, USA as Cassius Marcellus Clay. There is a rumor that Ali broke his mother's tooth with a punch when he was just six months old. Ali had a mischievous childhood, and when his bicycle was stolen, he found himself at the police station where he met Joe Martin, who was also a police officer. Joe told Ali that if he knew how to box, he wouldn't have had his bicycle stolen. Joe noticed Ali's long arms and broad shoulders and became his first boxing coach when Ali was only 12 years old. Muhammad Ali broke records by winning 95 out of the 100 amateur fights he participated in. In his professional career, Ali continued his success winning 15 out of the first 19 fights by knockout. He won his first major fight in 1964 against Sonny Liston, becoming the world heavyweight champion at the young age of 22. The fight was one of the biggest boxing events of that era, with a lot of verbal insults and taunts exchanged between the two boxers before the fight. Ali's heart rate was measured at three times higher than normal before the fight. Although Ali was not considered to have a definite chance to win, he managed to defeat his opponent in the sixth round and became the world champion. After the fight, Ali announced that he had converted to Islam and changed his name to Muhammad Ali. Later, Ali was called by the government to participate in the Vietnam War, but he refused to go, stating that the Vietnamese had never done him any harm. As a result, he was sentenced to five years in prison and fined $10,000. Ali was away from boxing for three years and faced serious financial difficulties. He won the court case in 1971 and returned to the ring to fight Joe Frazier in what was called the fight of the century. However, he lost his first professional fight against Frazier. In 1974, he fought Frazier again and this time he defeated him by a points decision. His second major victory came in 1974 against George Foreman one of the strongest boxers of that time, when he knocked him down in the eighth round to reclaim the World Heavyweight Championship. In 1977, Ali suffered a defeat against Leon Spinks, but he defeated him in a rematch a year later, becoming the first boxer to win the World Heavyweight Championship three times. Ali won the World Heavyweight Championship in 1964, 1974, and 1978, and defended his title against challengers 19 times. In his professional career, he fought in 56 matches and won 37 of them by knockout. He was only defeated five times in his career. When he retired from boxing in 1978, he was still the World Heavyweight Champion. Muhammad Ali was not only known for his extraordinary talent in the ring, but also for his unique style and presence. He was often considered a boxer artist due to his fluid and graceful movements, yet at the same time, highly effective and powerful. His unique stance allowed him to surprise his opponents and gain an advantage in many fights. Throughout his career, Ali constantly evolved and refined his ring presence, earning him a reputation not only as a great boxer, but also as an innovator. Ali's ring presence also reflected his personality. He was known for his high self-confidence and leadership qualities, which were reflected in his stance and demeanor in the ring. His influence extended far beyond boxing, as he became a symbol for social change, human rights advocacy, and an inspiration to many for his courage and determination. Ali was not just a boxer, but also a poet, actor, and television host, and his impact on popular culture and society was profound. After retiring from boxing in 1981, he faced health issues, including Parkinson's disease, but his legacy as an icon and inspiration remains strong to this day. Muhammad Ali's life outside of boxing demonstrates the extent of his impact as a personality. His political activism and advocacy for human rights left a more lasting legacy than his achievements in the ring, and his struggle continues to inspire people around the world. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I need your support as I am a beginner YouTube channel. Thank you.